I think hands down the mint cacao smoothie from Daily Harvest is my favorite. I never thought of this being like a smoothie flavor, but it is literally so good. If you're like a mint chocolate chip ice cream type of person, you need to try this. It's like having that in the morning, but healthy. It's insane. It feels so good like this week. I'm just getting back in my routine. I'm about to head out to the gym. I feel really motivated to just really, really take care of me in every possible way that I can. In the mornings, I'm like such a smoothie person. I love being able to wake up and make myself a smoothie. It's just so easy and it's really, really good right before I go to the gym. I literally always have Daily Harvest smoothies stocked up in my fridge. It's like a must have. For me, I drink them right before I go to the gym. I feel like it's a lot easier for me to not have something so heavy right before my workout, but enough to give me energy through my workout. And I'm literally getting a whole bunch of fruits and veggies like in this smoothie. It's banana, spinach, cacao, cashew, chillerella, peppermint, and it's literally so good. So I'm just getting a whole bunch of fruits and veggies with a little bit of chocolate. You guys, they have so many different types of smoothies. If you are not a mint and cacao person, they have so many different flavors. When you open the packaging, you can see how fresh it is, but also you can taste it. They have this uh, passion fruit and pineapple one. So if you're like a fruity person in the morning, this is a good one. My other favorite is the carrot and cinnamon. Sometimes I wake up and I just want something super wholesome, especially in the morning, especially during the winter time. I crave like a carrot cinnamon type flavor. This is so good. Like this is actually so good. They just came out with this spice pear and cranberry. Ugh. I already know it's gonna be good. Another one of mine is the strawberry and peach. For me, I just love having a smoothie in the morning. This is a really, really good mix of fruits and vegetables. Kinda sets you up for your day. For me, I feel like it regulates me, which then gives me energy, and it just tastes really, really good. So this has definitely become a part of like my morning routine lately. I'm obsessed. I'm in love with Daily Harvest. I'm talking about them all the time. I always have them stocked in my fridge. Daily Harvest just makes it so easy to make sure that I'm getting what I need in my diet consistently. Gluten-free, dairy-free, plant-based, foods delivered right to your door. Super easy, there's different plans you can pick from. What I like about it, it's totally customizable. So you can choose from a weekly delivery, a monthly delivery, anywhere from nine to 26 items within your box. You can add items, change your box size, change your selections, or completely skip the week altogether. They never use gums, preservatives, or artificial anything. So if that is a big concern for you, like it is for me this year, you don't have to think about it. Like their food is super clean. You just have over a hundred options you can choose from at any time of the day. I started with Daily Harvest back in January, but I've been consistent with them for the past like four months or so. So saying all that if you're looking for a nice way to incorporate fruits and veggies i highly recommend looking into daily harvest i do have a promo code for you so if you are interested you can get up to 40 dollars off your first box by using code alexis i will have everything linked in the description box while you have a promo code to use it's such a nice time to just give it a try i love it and i know you guys will too so when I was laying in bed for two weeks, taking my little break from the world that was much needed, I just did a lot of shopping. It was completely unnecessary. I mean, I found myself a little bored sometimes. So what did I do? Shop is very dangerous. But I like got this feeling that I just wanted new things. I mean, I sound superficial, but I wanted to kind of get new products and really, really take care of myself in 2022 in a way that I've never done before. I've never been a type of like cutesy girl, get ready every single day, dress up every single day. It's never been my thing. It probably won't be my thing every single day ever in my life if I'm being honest when I'm traveling with Roberto it's like I'm a different person I get ready every single day I do my makeup every single day and I honestly feel confident and I feel really really good the time spent to do that is beneficial and I've realized that and I kind of want to bring that into my 2022 through this vlog you're probably going to see so many hauls it's going to be ridiculous because I really wanted to take it up a notch and get new skincare that I've never tried before and just take my skincare up to a new level so I literally sat in bed for a week and researched watched so many videos from skincare doctors of like how to get my skin the way I want it to be so I'm excited to show you guys all the new stuff that I got for that I got products that will help me sleep better stuff for my hair I got stuff for my body care little tiny things that will just like kind of elevate my self-care routine to the next level I actually got a new skims package when I tell you this thing is huge She's huge. Um, I did open it up a little bit. I got this pajama set. You guys know I'm obsessed with the Skims pajama sets. The most breathable, comfortable pajamas I've ever worn. They're worth every penny. I have it in three colors now and I'm obsessed. I wanted to show you guys the rest of the stuff that I got. Oh, I've been wanting to do like a big Skims purchase for a long time because I've purchased a few things and I've just like learned once you have them, you have them. They're worth it. They're such good basics. Like I wish it wasn't worth it. I wish I didn't want to spend my money on it, but I do. And it is worth it to me. 
So your girl went all out. This is probably gonna be the biggest haul I've ever done in my life. Hopefully if you guys have been interested in skims, this can help you out to make some decisions. Um, and I'll tell you guys what collections I got them from and why. Let's get into it. So the first thing I got, I got a whole bunch of these. So I don't know if I'm gonna show you guys every color, but I got a whole bunch of these skim crops. I heard these were the literal best. That is not what I thought it was gonna feel like. This material is insane. Oh my God, these are gonna be so comfortable. I got these because you literally can't go wrong with a simple crop you really can't and honestly and me and skims i size up because some things are a little small i did get these in a large i honestly wish i got these in an extra large i do want it to be i want it to fit well and not like way up here on me so for my advice honestly i would size up in skims i, I would get an extra large if you have a bigger chest like me but i got it in this like cocoa this cocoa color and so cute can you guys just see this going with so many things these are just good tops to like just throw on with stuff and then i got it also in this tan color super 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 cute oh and then i got it in this birch <laughs> no no <laughs> i can't talk i just put the word orange and burnt into one word this birch <laughs> i need help i need help so i got this color and i got it in a burnt orange color which is super cute like this you can wear this out girl i love this color so much okay if you guys want to know this is in color copper not burnt orange sorry and then i think i also got it in black of course like and i think these are totally worth it the material alone is unreal it's not what you think it's not cotton i think this is from their fits everybody collection oh yeah i'm so excited about this so she came out with a whole bunch of like body suits i did want the tank top one because i don't know how i'm gonna look because i have a short neck so i have to be careful when i wear turtlenecks but i got this bodysuit um it's short it gets really hot in the summer so um i didn't want to get long sleeves and covering my legs i mean that's good for winter but i live in arizona so let's be real so it zips up in the back it's nice material i'm gonna have to try this on to see how i actually like this how i like the fit this is their all-in-one mock neck onesie long sleeve mid thigh oxy then i got I have this in white and black already and I wanted it in a different color and I love it so much. So I got her tank. This is her cotton rib tank in Heather Gray. I got it in a size large. I have this in white and black already and I just love it. It's just a good basic tank and um, the quality of them really, really holds up. Then I got her matching like shorts to go with it, which I love these. I love wearing these to bed. Same color cotton rib short, they're gray. I get these in extra large, so I have a big butt. Let's just be real. I do. Everybody's seen it. I know. These are the boyfriend boxers in the color Sienna. Um, I get these in extra large too. These ones, these boyfriend boxers are so comfortable for bed. Like I love, 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 love wearing these. I ordered some of her boyfriend tees just to throw it over one of these, throw it on with one of these. Oh, unreal. And then I also got it in the color Coco. Cocoa. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused with life. So it's cacao. Like, can I get it together? <laughs> I really need help. So I got it in this color too. If you have a bigger butt like me, you definitely need to size up in those. And then I got the ribbed leggings in the color bone. I already have the matching top to these and I don't have any of her leggings, so I wanted to try it. What else, ho? What else? What else, bitch? I got the same thing in the color uh, black because I already have the tank top and the shirt to match this as well. So it is not over yet. It's gonna keep going, just saying. The next thing that I got was, this is the cotton jersey long sleeve. I wanted to try some of her like actual long sleeve shirts and I heard her cotton collection was everything. So I just got one of these because I wanted to try it. it. Matches the leggings that I got too. So if I get cold during this time of year, throw that on. It is a nice material. I do love her cotton collection. I will say it's one of her best collections. Let's see what this says. Oh yeah, I'm excited about these. So I got, this is her boyfriend t-shirt in extra large in the color cacao. You're gonna see me in this all the time. This and this, about to be on my body every day. Like, wow. This is so, so, so nice. I need this in every color. Great, I'm gonna have a closet full of skims. So then I got the same thing in the color Sienna, which I love this color. Just a big one. Mm, oh, this is gonna be nice. Look at this, like I love the monochrome. I love, I'm fucking obsessed. I need to fucking stop. So I never tried her cozy collection and I wanted to try it. Stop playing with me. Kim, stop. This cannot be real. There's no way this is real. I'm obsessing over material things, that's so embarrassing. Back to reality. I got the joggers in the cozy collection. So nice. All right, this, is the, this is what I went on to buy and ended up with all this in my cart, so. 
I'll just tell you how that went. Get the matching set. So this is her cozy kit pullover in the color Bone. Probably will look like the dad off Bear Sting Bears, honestly, is what I'm gonna look like in that, but that's okay. That's fine, it's totally cool. Oh, I got another thing, wow, okay. I think I got the joggers in black as well, which is nice, because I wanted to like just wear the crop with this. I think that'd be so cute. Large extra large and the jo black joggers. So that was huge. That was huge. So for the second package that I got, I ordered some stuff off Revolve, which is like literally one of my favorite websites. I do have a Revolve favorites page linked down below with all my favorites. So if you guys wanna look through that, all the stuff will be linked in there. I am so excited. So this is more towards sleep, my skincare, my body care, and just like how I want to take care of myself. So a couple of the first things that I ordered, I got a whole bunch of products from the company Slip, not gifted. I actually bought this with my own money and been wanting to get one of their pillowcases for such a long time. It helps with anti-aging, anti-sleep crease, and anti bedhead it's really good for your hair um, my hairstylist told me since I wear my hair out and I straighten it a lot um, it's good to sleep on a silk pillowcase to not pull out your hair and to prevent split ends so I went and ordered one of their white pure silk pillowcases if I don't put my bonnet on before I go to sleep I'm okay and just for the health of my hair I knew that this is something that I wanted to get I'm always doing my makeup and washing my face and my hair is always in my face but I went ahead and got their silk headband and I just got this specifically for the purposes of when I'm doing my makeup or I'm doing my skincare to push my hair out of my face and then I got their pure silk mask I don't get acne and I started getting maskne so I heard this really really helps and also the ones you get at the stores and on Amazon have so much harsh chemicals in them. I wanted to get one that I can trust and I'm not just sitting there breathing whatever I'm breathing in all day long. This is a pure silk one, so it's also gonna help with bacteria. This one I'm just gonna continuously wash all the time. The next thing that I got was this hair towel. I got a new one. This one is definitely higher quality. It's really, really nice. What this is is just a rapid dry hair wrap. Um, it's a towel that smooths frizz, reduces split in, tangles, and breakage too. So very, very crucial, especially if if you have hair type like mine, coarse hair, curly hair, I definitely recommend getting a towel like this, especially if you suffer from severe breakage. Regular towels that you put on your hair cause friction, cause breakage. So, so I just got a fresh and new one of these for my hair. It's long overdue. This is something I definitely needed to upgrade and get. And this one's a lot bigger than the one that I have. So I'm excited about this. The next thing I got is this scalp and body scrub from OY. I believe that's how you pronounce it. And um, I love body scrubs. And the reason why I wanted to get an upgraded one, I wanted to get I used to use body scrubs all the time and I suffer with bumps on my skin, dry skin, crackly skin. I know I talk about this all the time, but it's really like, it's bad. And it's the only difference I ever seen in my skin ever is when I would consistently use a body scrub. I, mean, I wanna see how this smells. That smells so relaxing, you have no idea. Next, I'm um, talking about body. I saw this brand um, and I've seen like a lot of supermodels use this for their skin and it's called Coastal Brazil. It's their Kaya Jungle Firming Oil and I'm a person that needs a lot of hydration on my skin and I wanted a really, really good oil because I got Moroccan oil a while ago. It doesn't do it for me. I did get this sunflower oil that this esthetician gave me when I went to European Wax and I was like, yeah, I guess I'll get it. It's insane, it actually works. I think it's sunflower oil or jojoba oil. I'm not sure, but I will link that down below too. I've been obsessed with trying body oils because that's really what my body needs. I like to mix it in with my lotion. It's the best combination ever. If you have dry skin, girl, that is what you need to be doing. Stop playing with yourself. Um, so I got this and I wanted a more high quality oil just to see if it would make a difference. And I've seen a lot of people use that. It's made with pure natural ingredients. It's such a high grade product. Um, it literally has no fragrance. It's just like literally made from the jungle of Brazil. And like, that's literally what I'm all about. So I'm so excited to try this. For all body types, it's a firming oil. Key benefits, firms and tones, hydrates and nourish, revitalizes and brightens, helps tighten and improve skin texture, which that is everything I need. I will definitely give you guys a real review once I use it. So next thing I got for my body. So my mom brought this to my attention that I shouldn't be using the same rag to wipe my face that I use on my body. I saw this on Revolve and it's a face washer set. It contains two face wash cloths, antibacterial, allergenic, anti-aging, and made with a botanical blend. They're made from bamboo act to gently remove oil, bacteria, and sebum without irritating your skin. It comes like that, super cute, very, very aesthetic. So I'm just gonna set it on my bathroom counter 
like this. And it tells you how to take care of them and wash them too so they can last the longest. So, so that's all that I got from Revolve. And then I went to Sephora the other day. So um, I wanted to show you guys quickly what I got from here. I do have another package from Sephora coming, so beware. So I just picked up my favorite necessary body wash. Then I got some new moisturizer. I've heard so much about this First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Intense Hydration. I have really dry skin, so this is to help hydrate dry parched skin. I got the intense one. So I have really dry skin, so I'm hoping that this will help. And it's like inexpensive, just the fact that it comes in this big jar. This will last me for so long. Okay, and this next one I already opened and put the, the cap on. What I love about this one is made from kale, green tea, spinach, vitamins it's a superfoods cleanser basically and it's made super super clean it's from used to the people a nutrient rich gel loaded with cold pressed superfoods extracts from kale spinach to effectively cleanse skin remove buildup pores and balance your ph without drying i got this is a new cleanser so i'm probably gonna use this one okay now the next thing few things i got were makeup products so i went and picked up this airbrush flawless finish powder from charlotte tilbury i got it in the color tan so i just picked up one of these because i don't have a good powder and this product is really hyped so i wanted to try it for myself then i also from charlotte tilbury i got their pillow talk but I got it in their color Pillow Talk Intense. I don't know if this is gonna be my color. Like I need to definitely go darker, but I don't know if I need to go that dark. This is what it looks like. So that's it. I'm new to makeup, so I'm getting used to it. I don't know if I can work with this color just yet. It is a pretty color. So if you're looking for a good um, darker shade of a lip pencil, try Pillow Talk Intense. And I love Charlotte Tilbury's pencils. Their lip pencils are so good. I think the lip is perfectly fine. I think that's such a pretty color on me. Like I think that would go so good. I love a mauve color on my skin tone. I think that looks so good. And I ordered this from Morphe. Like one day I sat and watched this one guy talk about all his favorite lip products. The way he does his lips are so good. Like I don't, I, I could, I try, looked at so many videos and his was just the best. So I literally bought almost every product he said. But I got this Morphe matte liquid lipstick, color True Story, and he would put it in the middle of his lips to create that ombre effect. So pretty, so I had to get it, but that's the color there. That is such a perfect color. Oh, that is such a perfect color. I'm so excited to use this. So those are all the things that I got so far. I do have a few more packages coming through the week and I will show you, I got a whole bunch of makeup products coming and some more skincare products coming. Of course, it's not necessary to do anything like this. You don't have to do this to have a new year. Everything will be linked down below. I think it's cold enough to wear this in Arizona. It's, it's like cold and then it's not cold. It's the new year, so I'm really trying to dress up when I leave the house. Like, if you've ever seen me in public, you're probably like, why does she look like that? Because I just like never care what I look like. I will leave the house in any state and that's just not good. I'm not saying that habit's gonna go away. So if you ever see me looking busted, it is what it is. Um, I'm trying to do better. But I got this jacket, if you're wondering, from Free People. Literally my favorite. It's like an oversized tufted leather jacket. It has pockets. It's so comfortable. It's so nice on the inside. And it's just like a really good, nice, oversized jacket without being too much. Um, and then I'm just wearing this kind of tank from Zara that I got. And then my favorite pants that I'm wearing all the time from princess polly that i got in a princess polly haul that's on my channel my last one that i did i've been loving wearing tennis shoes like this with more of a dressier outfit i don't know i just think it's like a cute mix i think i'm gonna wear this to add some more color because it's like literally all black i'm going to start doing weekly vlogs on my channel so i'm gonna vlog weekly and post them every single Sunday. Just so, uh, this year I really wanna post more real content. I feel like I love my other videos, but I do want you guys to get to know my life like personally more. So I'm gonna be posting weekly vlogs, so look out for that. And this is the beginning to the first weekly vlog of 2022. So right now I'm about to leave the house and me and my mom are gonna go apartment shopping. I like want to move so bad, but there's like nothing in Arizona. Like designated a whole day to go out and look at places, so. That's what we're about to do. I'll show you a few of them.
like let go like a lot of people are under like it's like I think that hustle culture maybe created like I know like survivalists like keeping your family alive like making sure I have fire and make sure I have enough food and now it's like stress that comes from like, for a while like you really have to like wake up or it was like sometimes it's like okay this is my life whatever Okay, so right now I am in my office and I really want to change this room into a more inspiring room. I'm never really in here, so um, and I want to change that this year. So I really want to kind of switch around the furniture in here. I feel like if you're bored in your environment or just kind of like sick of it, a good way to kind of find new inspiration within it is to switch things around so i think i'm going to switch this room around and i went to ikea yesterday and i bought this vanity so i want to build the vanity i got a cheap one i didn't want to wait and i want to fix up this room buy an expensive one and then i not like it later because i don't really know what i want to do with my makeup station i just want to try this out to see if i like a vanity area or go back to doing it in my bathroom i'm going to start doing that i just got done cleaning the living room i'm washing my couch doing laundry laundry so that's clean out there and now I want to get into here and then I'm gonna go into my bedroom I was literally in the middle of rearranging my office I really need to wash my hair it's so bad it's getting to that point so I was in the literally in the middle of rearranging my office and then it just hit me out of oh, nowhere and I wanted a smoothie. And so I have a whole bunch of Daily Harvest smoothies stocked in my fridge. These are literally my favorite. Like when I'm not like too hungry, but I don't want a heavy meal, I just grab a Daily Harvest smoothie. It's just so easy. And they're always so good and just super healthy. So like Daily Harvest smoothies are it for sure. Milk, almond milk, it's my favorite. This and Elmhurst, Elmhurst is my other favorite. And um, this one is fine. They didn't change it on their plain, non-flavored, unsweetened milk. But if you get the vanilla milk, it has like preservatives now, natural flavor. <laughs> it's the best blender on the planet. I don't care what anybody says. Costco was having such a big sale on these over the holiday season, the Vitamixes. I don't know if they're still having it. If so, I will link it down below. But normally these are these are like six hundred dollars, and I got mine I believe for like three hundred and thirty, and these run like six hundred to five hundred to four hundred dollars, and they're having such a big sale. So I don't know if they still are. I hope so. My mom ended up getting one too because you just don't find this good of a blender on that big of a sale ever. I mean, I never have seen it, and I just walked in during the holiday season and it was on sale. And it literally blends anything. It's the best blender. It makes your smoothies so soft. Like there's no other blender that does it, does it like a Vitamix. Trust me, I've tried. Um, I didn't even realize how good a Vitamix was until I had one. <laughs> like you're like, oh, this is what a smoothie should taste like or feel like. Um, so I love it. So I'll link it down below if they still have it. This one tastes like Thanksgiving in your mouth. This one has banana, carrot, walnut, sweet potato, cinnamon, and nutmeg. What? Like the best combination ever. Okay, so this is what I have so far. I have my desk in the corner that you're sitting in. I moved the clothing rack here, the mirror over there, but then I forgot like the whole reason I'm doing this is because I have a vanity. I need to put somewhere like, duh. <laughs> So 
building the vanity it wasn't too bad of a build um this is like this is like 130 dollars us i'll have it linked down below if you're interested so it comes with a nice glass top so just in case you get makeup on it it's easy to get off so it just comes with one big drawer I can, like organize all my makeup in here why did i do this a long time ago i don't know why but so my mom ended up getting me this mirror to do my makeup for christmas so this is gonna be nice to really to be able to see like what i'm doing just in case like at night there isn't light so she got me this conair mirror so i'll link that down below and it's just super cute face mask eyebrows i'm gonna like do it here too like i just love being able to sit and take my time when it comes to makeup or skincare so i like well, of course will keep my face washed and stuff in the bathroom but i will actually do like say when i want to do my serums my ice roller my gua sha my oils for my face my masks my at home uh, facials i will do them here because it's gonna be so nice so these are all my old makeup brushes um just in case i'll keep them so i just kept them there it's all like my complexion stuff so i have my bronzers highlighters all my concealers and i have my all my blushes foundations powders and then in here i have my setting sprays my primers things like that and this is gonna be like my lipstick collection i don't have much now but i'm gonna get more this is my lip gloss up this is all my eyebrow stuff so anything to do with my brow and then this is like my mascaras eyeliners eyelash glue freckle freck pin that i got and then this is just like my makeup tools so that's just kind of how i organized it some of the clear ones are from the container store these white ones for were two bucks at target i got them last year so i don't know if they still have them but they are so useful and so inexpensive if you want to organize your drawers and that is my new little vanity area okay i wanted to quickly show you guys that i moved the vanity into my room i know it's cramped it's not going to always be like this i'm literally growing out of this space so much so um this won't be here it's just way for now because there's nowhere else i could put it but i kind of like it i just sit in front of my window and have my little vanity area so i did move it into here it's a little cluttered but it's really really peaceful when i've been getting ready here in the morning i love it this little vanity from ikea actually looks kind of luxurious in a way i need a new stool don't look at that i even did my skincare here this morning like i did my gua sha my rolling tool and it was just everything so i'm really really loving this addition okay so i got a few more packages that i wanted to show you guys i posted a story on my instagram the other day um and i was just like i haven't haven't stopped non-stop shopping since january 1st and you guys like post it all and i was like i am so i do a lot of like extra posting on there so a lot of the stuff I will be posting on my Instagram, like how I style it, so more so for my fashion. If you're not following me on my Instagram, you need to be linked down below. I wanted to show you guys a few new things that I picked up. I got a package from Saks Fifth Avenue, and I was looking for black boots for the longest time, and everywhere, well, everywhere they're sold out, for one. Like, you can't get black boots like this. They're sold out. So I just could not get any. And then I just, like, typed in Google, and Google has, like, this cool feature. If, like, you type in what you want, it'll pull up all the stores who have that exact item. That's how I found these. So everywhere they're sold out, for one. Like, you can't get black boots like this. I picked up a pair of these black leather boots boots which i'm so excited for i cannot wait to style these they're gonna look so cute with so many things there were so many times when i was in paris where i was like i wish i had a pair of black leather boots a little pump that i can walk around in for a couple miles and not like kill my feet and i didn't have any so i was like when i came home i needed them this is an essential like you can style this with so many different things it's just staple to have in the closet i love how they're pointed toe look more sophisticated i wish the heel was a little longer because it's giving me a little bit of a witch a witch shoe it really is but i put them on already and they look good on so i wanted to show you guys these. so the next place i got was fourth and reckless and this is from the victoria's secret model who came out with a store her stuff is priced pretty well i'm actually shocked but i saw these and i had to have them like they were calling me you know those pieces you find and you see and they just like sing to you like you need them this was it you know what i could do with these do you know what i could do with these oversized faux leather zebra heel oh my god can you just see this with an all black fit oh the heel on this is like perfect i think they're pointed super cute so i got these from fourth and reckless i'm obsessed with them I cannot wait to style those. Um, I do have an outfit planned for it, but I want to go out to dinner and wear it. 
birthday is coming up next month. So I think I might be going to like an island somewhere. I don't know. I really want to go somewhere tropical. I was thinking about the Bahamas or the Maldives. I don't know yet. I'm going to pick, but I just want to like do me on my, my birthday. I just want to like have a good time, relax. I might go somewhere and do that. So I, I need to get some summery type stuff, but yeah. So this one is from 20 to fall or 20 of fall i'll link it down below um but oh my god when i saw these you have no idea i needed them in my life i am obsessed with green and i love this feather trend that's going around right now it might be going out of style just a little bit like i might be late to the trend but i don't care it is so cute i can do so much with this so i got it this is actually a shirt if you have a small booty that probably will work for you not for me um but yeah i got this feather kind of feather shirt can you guys just see me rocking this with like heel i picked this up and if you are kind of smaller in the waist and but it's a one size fits all it probably could fit you as a skirt too um and i got one in white too because you can never go wrong with white like you can just do so much with with the white one and then i got oh this is when i saw this i had to have it then i got this insane jacket insane like this is such a good find like i can't even believe it's in my hands right now it is an oversized faux i think it's faux leather how perfect is it can you because it's so loud i would do like a basic outfit underneath and then put this on over and it just like does it you know what i mean so um so it's like a british store that i found on instagram and they're really they have really good stuff like there was a few jackets i actually wanted to buy from i don't have anything like this in my closet so i wanted a few different pieces that i can really kind of start showing off my style and things that i love more the next thing that i got was oh, a new makeup brush set which i've been needing for so long i went ahead and bit the bullet and bought myself ariel's brush set with morphe that he did why is it so cute like if i came out with a product it would look like this it's so aesthetic it is brushes i literally am set for life like literally set for life i seen this i don't know if you know her she's another youtuber her name is lisa um she's from amsterdam and she was i watched all her makeup videos i was watching her and she said she loves these brushes so i went ahead and ordered them but if you're wondering this comes with a setting and bronzing brush, foundation brush, cream contour brush, powder contour brush, blush brush, precision setting brush, fluffy blending brush, crease blending brush, packer brush, smudging brush, dual ended concealer brush, um, soft sculpting sponge. Pick this up, I will link these down below. I haven't used them yet, so I can't give you a review. The only review I have is from Lisa. I trust that girl though. If you, if you go click on her channel, you'll know why. Um, she's so beautiful and the way she does makeup is it. I'm just excited. I feel like I've done nothing but hauls in this, video, this vlog. So I'm about to head out to lunch with my mom. We're gonna go to my favorite Italian place. I wanna show you guys, but I wanna show you guys what I'm wearing. So on this long coat that I got from Zara, I'm wearing my Nike Dunk Lows and then I'm wearing my Skims Cozy Collection pants and then Tank. And then I threw on my little mini white Bottega to add some color. Something super cute and casual. So you have to come to this place and get the Italian salad. It is so good. I get mine with a side of ranch and heated up grilled pieces of chicken. Wow. Just put them in. Guess what she's eating? 